I need patience and I need it now. How often have I felt that way? How about you? This morning I will continue my series on the fruits of the Spirit and my topic obviously is patience. Unlike the ones I've discussed earlier, there are only 19 mentions of patience in the Bible. Most of them are about God putting up with our shortcomings or telling us we need to practice patience. But there are no suggestions about how to do it. I recall a story a good friend told me. First, I want you to know that this man and his spouse were among the most sharing, caring couples ever. They were leaders in the church, the community, and their professions. He was under a great deal of turmoil and stress with his work, and it seemed as if he had run out of patience with everything and everybody. It had been slowly building up, but suddenly it seemed to escalate as if everything was primed to thwart his every effort. Something dawned on him. He immediately called his wife and asked her, Have you been praying for me to have patience? The answer was yes. He begged her, Please stop. The point is, Patience is not something that can be given to us. It is more like physical conditioning in that we have to start small and build up our strength. Pick some minor but frequent irritant in your life and focus on that. Do whatever it is you do when you need to calm down, such as stop and take a few slow, deep breaths, then decide the irritant will no longer run your life. Continue until it becomes reality. Then move on to another one. Like physical conditioning, the process never ends. But if you stay in shape, it is much easier, and you will find the process becomes almost automatic. God bless you, and have a good week.